Hello, this is our call learning code by Jumbo. And today is day 30. I would like to guide you how to sorting string, sorting the student number, name, error, assigning order in Java. So here, in the application, I will allow the user to enter the student name in a, in a, an array. And after that, I will uh, sorting the order of the student in the array by uh, alphabet. You mean, I mean the ascending order. Okay, so now let's get started. This is the uh, Eclipse, and I will I will create a new uh, class inside the main packet. Okay. So here I will name it E. Okay, I will name it E. Sorting, sorting student name. Okay, and create main method. Here I will import library. Okay. Uh, scanner SC scanner yeah okay here system dot um green la green Enter the total student. And as yes, you know, next line. So here we will be ignore the next line character. Okay, here, so after that, I will create a string array. String. Um, name. String. Uh, total. Okay, here, I copy this. student name okay and here I will be using the for looping for zero total e blood blood I will have our Enter student name. Uh, it will be the student one, two, three. Okay. I will have the the student name I see dot like line okay cool and here in this step we have finished enter the how many people I mean how many students uh, we allow the user to enter the total student and after that we enter the name for those, those students okay so the next step we are going to sorting the uh, student name four zero
but another for z equal one z plus n total student z plus plus if a student student name z minus one dot compared to compared to student name z greater than zero I, okay, so I will be creating a temporary string. String. String temp. String temp equals to the name. Uh, name. the name z equal string them yeah okay and of course after we do sorting so we have to print out the the sorted order of the of the the, the array and after that display it out of the screen Okay, screen here. I will be using the system. Dot uh, green line. Okay, I will have the sort the to the name in uh in sending order for Okay, and now I will try to run. And before we run the application, I will try to explain in more detail for you. Okay, here, this this code we are uh, allow the user to enter the total number of students they want to be enter the name here. So it will be the input for the the total of the ar array in the student name string here. Okay, so after that we are using the for looping to loop over all of the student here and after that we enter the name for each student okay so when we have the student array so we are using the uh, we are going to do the sorting student here so here we do the sorting student in the ascending order that means all of the people uh, all of the student will be sorting by alphabet Okay, so here after that we have a sorted list student. So we are going to another step. The last step we are display all of the student in the array to the uh, to the console app. Okay, here let me run it for you. Okay, here 
So firstly, we enter the total student. I will enter the three student year. Yes, next step is said we have to enter the, the student name and enter the student name one. I will enter the student student two e uh, student three e tang enter year. So you can see here after we enter three student and it will display the student in the shortest list e Jian Herb and Tang. Yeah, so here the C, Ed and T, E are in assigning. assigning. Okay, cool. So here I will try with another student. And I will enter the five students. The first should be the, 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 the Tang, Jian Herb. Yeah. So here, after that, it will start things the other order E, C, Chien, C, Chien, Ed, Herb, G, Tang, and G, Jues. Okay, cool. So here, you can enter how many students, it is depending on the purpose. So after that, you can enter the data for that, uh, enter the name for that student and do the sorting. Okay, so I hope this video will have fun for you and you can be on this basic uh, demonstration and apply it in the project. Okay, hope that helped and let me know if you see any issue. Bye bye, see you later.